I'm Jennifer Angel. These are your stars for August, Gemini. Now, your month ahead. With a new moon in your solar fourth house on the 29th, family matters will take on a higher level of importance. There is a new start in stars, which signifies that something is about to change. So it's good news. Uh, there is a positive vibe around you right now, but don't leave life to fate alone. You need to be proactive to ensure that things pan out the way that you want them to. Now at work, it is easy to get a start. It, it is easy at the start of the month, rather, um, just to get infatuated with something or someone. So try to be neutral until you find out what is actually happening, what's going on behind the scenes. Now with planet Mars in your sign at the start of the month, life will present, let's say, some challenges. But without challenge, you rarely move forward. So if you feel like you are being pushed to the limit, just know that you are moving in the right direction, okay? This month you can make changes on a personal level when you broaden your and when you broaden your horizons, anything is possible. Um, if your intentions are to have an in-depth discussion with someone, then keep in mind that Mercury, the planet of communication, the planet that also rules your sign, is retrograde for most of the month. So you will need to approach a sensitive conversation with ease and some diplomacy. Try not to get caught up in what other people think. Even if family think that they do know best, at the end of the day, it's your life to live and your decisions to make. Now your lucky numbers for the month, Gemini, are 2, 3, 22, 23, 27, and 30. And your defining day is August the 3rd. Planet Mars has a positive effect on your business and can provide the, provide the motivation to move ahead. So Mars is a very motivating sort of go-getter planet, so use that to your advantage. That's your stars for this month, Gemini. Thanks for watching. I'm Jennifer Angel.